So I just want to start off, I'm Athletic Director Mark Beatty, and it's my honor today to recognize Aiden on his letter of intent for Seattle University. And I think this picture right here sums up a lot of things. Absolutely. You know, when Aiden runs, and in the last four years, you know, when I've seen Aiden on the track or in cross country, he, he runs with a lot of joy. And running is a sport that's really, really tough. Uh, that's why so few people compete in cross country and track because it's extremely difficult and takes tremendous discipline to get up early in the morning and put in the miles or in the evening when their friends are doing lots of fun activities. So Aiden has really put in the work and he's doing, just done some amazing things and we're hoping that we get him to state this year and you got to persevere through a lot of things. And Aiden's proven that he can do that through the, through the sport of running. And he's going to need that right now because, you know, he's, he's going through a little bit of a hard time right now. But we know Aiden has the perseverance. He's demonstrated that. And you have all of us as your family, and we're going to support you. All right? <laughs> So again, Aiden, for me, I'm proud of you. Can't wait to see what you do at Seattle. And Coach Kelowna, I'm gonna turn it over to you. Um, I've been with Aiden, this is four years, four years cross country, four years track. He's one of these athletes that makes coaching enjoyable to go through with somebody like that that has so much enthusiasm, excitement, and the love of what he's doing. Uh, it makes my job easier, makes it fun. Um, you know, it, it's, he's, he's great at that. You, again, you can see the picture. He actually stole the headlines a couple years ago in the Madison County meet. He got second place in the mile, but he had the headline, he had the picture in the paper, and he had the article because he was so excited. That was his fastest <laughs> mile ever. He's jumping around hugging everybody, and, and even the Alton Telegraph got uh, into it. Uh, putting him on the cover and then the guy that won it was in the background. So that's due to, that's due to his, his excitement. Uh, he's worked very hard for me these four years. He's had many accomplishments. Uh, he's been all county, all conference. Uh, he was even triple jump champion one year in the old Prairie State Conference we were in. Uh, he's done many things. I've gone to sectionals in track and uh, in, in cross country. Uh, the only thing he hasn't accomplished is what he's mentioned is going to the state meet. We've been close, we've been real close. Uh, this year we're gonna knock the door down and go in. We have, that's on our schedule. Uh, we got sectionals at 18th here at our track, uh, which gives him a little bit of advantage running at home. And uh, we're, he's gonna get that done. We're gonna have a good time going up to Charleston this year. Uh, but uh, he has been a joy to coach. Um, done everything we ask him to do. You know, sometimes we have to calm him down when he gets too excited. He, he starts rambling on what he wants. He wants to do this first, and he's, he's already two weeks in the future. But uh, he, is, he has been awesome to coach, uh, and he's done everything, like I said, that a runner could do. Um, I wish him real well in Seattle. Make sure you got a good raincoat out there uh, because he's going to get wet. But it's, it's going to be fun to watch him in the future, and we'll watch him online. It's a good thing now we can watch these athletes that go to college online and see, see what's going on. And um, I know he's going to do very well. All right? Let's give a nice round of applause for Aiden Nelson. All right. So camera's ready. We'll, we'll pause this a few times for photo ops. So um, Aiden, get your pen. And you're going to sign one of your five letters of intent right there. One of five. Aiden, did you want to say a few words? You have anybody you want to thank? You can just do it like me. I have no script. Just go from the heart. Congratulations again. Thank you. Um, I don't even know. I, I kind of just want to start by saying thank you to everybody from 
family, to friends, to the Robinsons for taking me in these past few days. Um, it's it's been been a fun few days. It's been a mess. Um, <sighs> got a piece of my dog with me. And, um, I don't really know what to say. Just just thank you to everybody and everybody who made this happen. Um, yeah. So proud of you. You're welcome, buddy. Well, we're really proud of you as well, and great job. I was up there for vacation. I had no, no idea about the school. It was just something my mom set up an interview, and honestly, I woke up the morning, and I didn't even really want to go. I, I was just grumpy, tired. I mean, we'd been, we took a train out there, and it was three days on the train, so I mean, by that time, I was pretty tired, and I didn't really want to get up in the morning and go. But then we got there, and I went on a tour of the campus, and it was just amazing. And then I probably spent like an hour and a half in the tour, but then three hours afterwards with the coach just walking around, we were talking, we were kind of exploring the campus, and then we sat in the team room and just discussed everything for a while. And honestly, from that point, I think I knew that's where I wanted to be. So it's it, this season's been really fun. It's been, for me, it's been about trying to get as strong as I can, not necessarily for this year, but just to make sure that I have the strength I need to get through a collegiate season. So it, it's been great. Everybody that's followed me, everything, um, everybody's been so helpful and so supportive. I don't know if you know, but on Saturday while, I was, while me and my sister were at prom, our house caught fire and had burned. And just this community couldn't have been any more supportive. My family's here right now. We're, we're, we're kind of trying to rebuild and get things back to us kind of normal so we can finish the school year and kind of get through the season. Just, I mean, everything. Coaches helping me through the years kind of telling me one thing and then I finally figure out what he meant by that <laughs> when I have three weeks left in the season. He's only been saying it for four years, but I now, I now know what he means. Um, it, it's been a big learning curve. Every, every step of the way, I'm always getting better, learning new things. Um, and I'm just really excited for next year. Can't wait to see what it brings.